hi friends welcome back to baho automation lab once again and in this online video session we'll start learning cucumber bd framework with selenium 4 so cucumber bd framework is the most popular framework in nowadays and most of the industry uh, is using cucumber bd framework for automation purpose we'll try to learn everything about the cucumber and bd framework step by step from scratch to advanced level so watch this videos very carefully so we'll you get you will get the better idea and how to develop this framework what is the concept related to this framework using using let us selenium 4 version okay so without wasting time let's start with the, some theoretical part so first of all let's understand what is mean by cucumber so cucumber cucumber is the open source testing framework that supports behavior driven development or the automation testing of web applications okay so cucumber is the open source testing framework that is supported for behavior driven development for automation testing of web application what is mean by this behavior driven development will understand step by step okay so this tests are first written in the simple scenario from that describe the expected behavior of the system uh, from the user perspective so behavior driven development uh, the tests are first written in the simple scenario uh, from that describe the expected behavior of the system uh, from the user perspective and cucumber is a testing framework that enables behavior driven development okay by allowing this test uh, to be written in the human readable format uh, using using gherkin language so what is mean by this gherkin language what is mean by this behavior driven development how it will support it uh, uh, to uh, allow user to enable behavior driven development and in human readable uh, format we'll understand all these things step by step in the practical session okay and i'm not believing in this theoretical part that much we are most believing to the learn everything in the practical basis but for to your understanding purpose and just understand this uh, concepts in theoretical like what is cucumber and uh, what is this behavior development driven development everything so create notes from your point okay so it's pro it promotes the collaboration and understanding the among stakeholders okay automate states and ensure that software behaves as expected okay it's uh, totally uh, un like a collaboration between the stakeholders and uh, promoters now let's understand what is mean by bdd cucumber okay so bdd is the behavior driven development is a way to developing the software that emphasize good communication and understanding between the people involved okay so what is behavior driven development it's a develop, developing of software emphasis good communication understanding between the people and involved people okay it's easy it's used to clear language and to describe how the software should be behave and automate test make sure it does so bdd uh, it is use clear language to describe how software is behave and automate test uh, to make sure it does what is mean by this uh, describe how soft software is behavior so it's clear language means it's a simple plain english we'll understand this whenever we develop any feature files or uh, um, scenarios in our automation process so you will get idea what is meant by this clear language and what is uh, software behavior should be behave in the clear language okay so bdd helps ensure that everyone is on the same page about what the software should do and that it meets those expectations okay so all the stakeholders and testers and everywhere everyone involved in the automation process it, it should be on the same page so that what exactly uh, software is behaving and it, it meets this, those ex expectations or not we'll check that in bdd so what is this gherkin so gherkin is the business readable language that cucumber understand okay we are um, develop the scenarios and uh, our feature files everything in the gherkin language so gherkin language is a business readable language everyone can understand that because it is a in simple plain english language it's a domain specific language and that's described the software behavior all the software what how software is behaving everything will describe in the uh, 
Gherkin language. So Gherkin is the plugin English text uh, English text language which is helps to Cucumber to interpret and execute uh, the test cases. Okay. Now it is designed to be non-technical and human readable way to describe use uh, use case in the software. So it means um, anyone can understand what is exactly uh, going on in the automation process because it's in the non technical person also uh, read that it, it, it is a simple plain lang English language. So, Gherkin keywords like feature file, feature file is the high level description of software features or test scenarios. Each feature file of the Cucumber testing start with the feature key keywords. Scenario used to describe the specific test scenario. Each feature contains the required number of tests to test the feature. And given is the describe the prerequisites of given test scenario keyword refers. This given keywords is refers to precondition of test. Okay. So whenever we do practically, we'll create a one like file feature file. In that we have all these working keywords, and you will understand what you mean by this, all these things. Just for understanding purpose. Just for your notes purpose, let me just note down the feature, what is feature file, what is scenario, and what is this keywords like given, uh, like, and when, and everything. Okay, so when describe an event on action. Whenever you given any, like, uh, keywords like when, it will describe event or action. Usually, refers to action of user that is executed. Okay, then is refers to outcome uh, of the previous step of upcoming action. And uh, and is described or provide a logical and conditions between statement. It is used to add a condition into the our step. So feature file uh, one. Let's see one example related to the feature file where we have used these keywords. For example, feature file is withdrawal of money from ATM. So feature uh, feature keyword should be with this colon withdrawal money from ATM. After that, the scenario should uh, come with this uh, keyword like a scenario withdrawal money from ATM using correct ATM card pin. Now, given is describing I having I have a, like a fifty thousand RS in my account. Okay, and then when I enter the correct ATM card pin, then I should be withdrawal to two thousand from my account. Simple. So it's a plain English language feature about withdrawing money from the ATM. Okay, let's understand the advantage uh, of using BDD and Cucumber. So it improve the collaboration. What is mean by the improved collaboration? It means BDD encourages the collaboration between the stakeholders such as the developer, testers, and business re representatives. So it will the collaborate everything and on the same page. Okay, it provides a common language working that space uh, facility facil facilitate the effective way okay and uh, also communication and understanding of the software behavior so bdd is uh, advantages as bdd like in encourages the collaboration between stakeholders testers and developers and it's provide a common language so that everybody can understand it okay it's communication understanding and the behavior and is it is in the business readable uh, test so that anyone can understand that test Right. So tests written in the working syntax are easy to understand or both technical and non-technical team members can easily understand that test. Okay. This allows a business stakeholders to validate and verify expected behavior, behavior of the software. So business readable test. So whatever we are written in the working syntax only or working language only. So non-technical people uh, from the uh, like uh, those having not a like development or the testing background, they, they can also easily understand our test execution process. Okay, so test documentation. Uh, for example, in the third advantage is like the test documentation is like a Gherkin feature file. Sir. So the is leaving documentation for the software behavior. They provide a clear constant description uh, of various scenarios, making the easier to maintain and reference the expected behavior. Okay, and early bug detections. What is mean by that early bug deduction? So BDD supports, so BDD promotes the writing a test before implementing the code. Okay, because in because it is in the simple plain in language and then working scenario as per the documentation, we can create our scenarios. So we 
um, so BDD is the behavior driven development will be promoted to return a test before implementing the actual code. This approach helped to identify the address or potential issues, issues and misunderstanding early in the development process. Because of before developing, we are developing our like uh, scenarios and everything so that maybe there are some any misunderstanding between the documentation part or related to that part we can um, we can like identify that bugs early of the development process and reduce the leak code and uh, under introducing the bugs so before uh, like uh, after the development if any bug is occurred before that we are we are like uh, capture that bug in the documentation part only so this is the advantage of using BDD and Cucumber. Let's understand the disadvantage of BDD and Cucumber. So, so learning curve. What is meant by the learning curve? So adapting the BDD and understanding the Gherkin syntax maybe requires some initial efforts and learning. Team members, uh, like uh, particularly those new in the BDD, need to become a familiar with the principles of practice associated with, with BDD. I don't think so. This is the any like uh, disadvantage of using BDD. But for the new people those we are uh, like in the like so software industry if you are or if you want to learn in something you have to learn that concept right so bdd is something like you have to learn that concepts and then you can able to implement that, that the things yeah we require some important uh like uh, familiar with the bdd syntax and everything man but this is the learning part you have you should learn if you want to learn everything any <coughs> concept in any IT industry okay so uh, if it is related to the language if it is related to the like uh, soft uh, any like software you have to learn that software right you have to learn that language as well so it, it i don't think so learning curve is the um, biggest advantage of using disadvantage of using bdd cucumber because you, you should learn anything that the way you have to learn bdd cucumber as well so increase overhead it means bdd introduce the additional layer of abstraction which is may increase the complexity and overhead written the maintenance test cases because whenever there are multiple test cases we have to maintain the feature files properly so yeah we can say this is the like a smallest disadvantage of using building cucumber okay now let's understand the the third execution time so execution time this ability to test um, Particularly, those written in the behavior driven style can be slower executed compared to the unit test the additional layers of interruption interruptions and abstraction may be impact the test execution okay so uh, what is meaning by this it's uh, like build test particularly those written in the behavior development so that it will be take some execution time uh, more than the normal test case execution but um, it's not that much high okay it's very uh, simple like unit as compared to unit test but it's uh not that much much of everything but it's yes is it little disadvantage of using bdd and cucumber so this ad, uh, disadvantage uh, is not that much as higher as compared to other test frameworks it's it's simple disadvantages okay so depending on stakeholder engagement so this is the biggest advantage disadvantage so bdd uh, reels on like active engagement of particular uh, of participations from all the stakeholders okay so as per the this four advantage i think this is the biggest advantage uh, disad uh, as per this four disadvantage i think this uh, dependency of stakeholder engagement is the biggest uh, disadvantage of using bdd and cucumber only okay other things are smaller disadvantage so bdd deals the active engagement of participations from all the stakeholders if stakeholders are not fully committed to lack of understanding in the bdd process the effectiveness of bdd may be compromised co compromised okay so we required uh, all the stakeholders should be fully committed to the uh, this development bdd development process if they are not understand something related to the bdd then it will be our like effectiveness of our bdd framework will be compromised so these are the uh, exactly uh, documentation part related to the bdd and uh, cucumber framework advantage of disadvantage uh, di advantages disadvantages okay and uh, what is mean by the bd cucumber what is mean by the getting keywords and the part in the next session we'll 
uh, start learning the practical session like installation and set up a Maven Cucumber project uh, in your system. And uh, also we learn installation of Eclipse Cucumber in, and create a Maven project in Eclipse and uh, add Cucumber Java Maven dependency in our pond.xml and etc. Okay, so let's meet in next session. Till time, have a great day. Bye bye. Take care.